Where art thou? The theme of today's prayer comes from Genesis chapter 3, verses 1 through 9. The question is, where art thou? This question was asked by God to Adam. And Adam and Eve were given specific instructions and they were disobedient to God. They were aware of the action. They were aware of their disobedience. God asked them this question already knowing the answer. And so the question that we need to ask ourselves is where are we? And it's a wide question. When you say where are you, normally we may think of it geographically. You know, where are you? New Jersey, Jamaica, New York, you know, Hackensack, Englewood, where are you? But today I would like for us to think about that question as it relates to our life. Where are you in your plans? In your goals? In your promises? Your relationships? Where are you? In your purpose? Where are you in your emotions? Where are you in your life? Where are you in your to-do list? Have you started? Where are you in making that change that you need to make? Where are you in your health? Where are you in your wealth? Where are you in your decisions? So that question is broad. It means something different to each of us. And true, for this list that I drafted, it could even be longer. So for each of us, we need to reflect today uh, to find out where is, what instructions did God give to us in our life? What was the assignment that God gave to us? What have we done? in relationship to that which God has told us to do. Where are we in that? Where are we in God's purpose for our lives? Where are we in the plans that we should be making for our lives? So it really, it really is going to be unique for each of us. So the prayer today is, Lord God, as you ask that question to Adam and Eve in the garden, you, Father, are our creator. You created us for a purpose. You have given us instructions. You have given us provisions. And you have made your request known to us. We, Father, have gone astray. None of us are perfect. We have done, most of us, what we have wanted to do, which has been contrary to what you have instructed us to do. And even though you know the answer, here is the opportunity, Lord, for us to reflect, to come clean, and to respond, to ask you forgiveness, to ask you to restore us to where we should be in our lives, to where we should be in our health, in our wealth, in our relationships, in the promises that we have made, in the actions that we should be taking. We are off course. Father, some of us are even lost. We're so far off where we should be that we might not even know where we are. 
but you know where we are, God. And we are asking you to help us to be where we should be, to redirect our path, to restore what we have lost. Father, we commit ourselves to you, for you, O oh God, to bring us back to that place. We ask that you will not cast us away or remove us from your presence. But you will give us another chance that you will have mercy upon us, O God, and that you will help us to regain our position of favor with you. This we ask of you today, Lord God. In Jesus' name, amen.